Hello everyone, it's BYG Agami back with another video. Now today we got news regarding the new mechanic for Yu-Gi-Oh! 6 or Yu-Gi-Oh! Varanes. So the new mechanic is called Link Summon and this information came from a forum known as NeoArcadial.net and I do want to say thank you for Neo Arcadia for posting this information as well as the translation. So the new mechanic will not be anything to write home. So that means it's going to be something pretty damn big and impactful. Also the new mechanic is going to come Come out in July or so, so somewhere around there, within a few months. But that's kind of strange because Yogo Six is going to be airing in April. Now I, I never, I don't know when um Pendulums or XYZs got introduced, as well as um Synchrons. But I'm pretty sure they would come around the time you know 5D's Zexal or Arc Five are airing, right? So that's kind of weird, but. The fact is that Dakotalker is a cyber type monster and is related to Link Summon. So that seems to be the new mechanic. So I thought Dakotalker was a what's it called? He was a warrior type just because of the sword and stuff, but it seems that Yusaku is going to have a cyber space cyber type deck. Like that's going to be his monster. Um, that's going to be his Nisha monster. The arrival of Link Summon will gut out or is intended to gut out Zodiac and make Ultimate Conductor Tyranno the new metagame from April or so onwards. The fact is I don't play that much yu gi as I used to, but I know that Zodiacs are the current meta. So it's interesting to see that Link Summon will gut out or intend to knock these out of the park. In addition to that, XYZs and Synchron centric decks basically die in the face of Link Summon. That sucks, dude, because I'm a huge Synchro guy. I've I run a Quasar deck, so my deck is basically going to get murked compared to Link Summons. The Code Talker is not Yusaku's full ace coward. However, it's really strong and essential, and essentially a vital card for Link Summon. It's a 23 hundred or so attack like junk warrior the 2500 attack ace is somewhere else so that's kind of weird because in the v jump they stated that or my bad in the weekly jump they stated that that's yusaku's ace monster which is quite interesting but it's good to know because i want to see what they're hiding i really do want to see what they're hiding now i would be con I, I was content with um deco talker being yusaku's ace monster i like the design i still like the name that's the only thing i didn't like but it's interesting i can't wait to see this link summon play out and see how it affects the card game because i know when pendulums came out they affected the card game drastically so it's going to be interesting. So subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content. As always, I will deliver the fastest news relating towards Yu-Gi-Oh! The 6th series or Yu-Gi-Oh! Varanes.